Even though I have friends, I don't really feel like anyone really knows me. How can I let them know what's really going on inside me? Signed, The Real Deal. Hmm, interesting. Does anyone ever really know the real you? Every part of you? Do they need to? Dear Real Deal, that's an interesting question. Oh no, not again! What's wrong with this site? Why does it keep crashing when I've got like a million questions to answer? Maddie! There's a big surprise down here for you! A surprise? I love surprises! Where is it? What is it? Who sent it? It's from your father. He must be missing us. He also sent me these beautiful roses. Aw, Dad. Remember, I'm home early tonight to take Amelia to her doggy hypnosis. See you. Mwah. Mwah. Isn't this exciting, Amelia? What'd he send me? What'd he send? <sighs> me. A magic set? Pink's my favorite color. I love it. <laughs> No, really, I've always wanted a flowery hat. Don't be silly. Of course I'm not too old for dolls. Ugh. I mean, is it too much to ask that my father might actually send me something I like? Does he even know what I like? Does he even know me? Someone's in a dark mood. Well, it's lovely to see you two. I'm sorry. It's just that, well, first up, the school website keeps crashing. <gasps> Someone mentioned technical difficulties? Mm. Uh, yeah, actually, there's something wrong with the school website. What were you trying to access? Uh, oh, I was, uh, uh, I was trying to download a recipe, a recipe for a home economics. Yeah, yeah, home economics. But you don't take home ec. Doesn't mean I don't like their recipes. All right, all right, I'll check it out. Moody or what? So, you want to tell us what's really going on? This is what's going on. Whoa, I sense some really powerful energy here. Which would be great if you're into energy, which I'm not. Which seems to be something that escaped my father's attention. Huh, parents, what are you going to do? Mine are totally the same. They know I'm into fashion, and for my birthday, a book. I mean, like... I know. Don't they know anything about us? This magic set, probably a good present for like a two-year-old. Magic set, cool, with magic handcuffs, even cooler. I rest my case. Work your magic, Maddie, and escape from this. There's nothing magic about it, Stinky. Someone pass me the key, please. Uh, anytime you feel like it. Uh, Maddie? Yeah, there's no key. <gasps> ah! What were you thinking? Obviously I wasn't thinking. Duh, like I want to be stuck with you all day. Trust me, if I have to saw my arm off to get out of this, I'll do it. Fine, let's just get a seat. Fine. I always sit on that side. Well, today you're sitting on this side. Hey, Stinky, who's your new girlfriend? <laughs> yes, yeah, Stinky. You and Maddie, best friends forever, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Happy 18th birthday, sweetie. I got it. <gasps> Should I make a wish?
Does this mean I graduate too? <sighs> you may now kiss the bride. Ew, gross! Well, it is. Ah! Hey, what are you doing? Well, how else am I supposed to write? Write with your right hand. No, you write with your left hand. <laughs> okay, you've got 30 minutes for the pop quiz starting now. <sighs> oh, brother. One test I definitely failed thanks to you. I can't help it if I'm left-handed. We're getting these off right now. We're going to my place and looking for that key. No can do, I'm afraid. Oh. Not right now, anyway. I got important things to do. Oh, no, you don't. Uh, and I'm late. Stinky! I mean, it was awesome. see what Stinky did to Maddie's head? I can't believe we won like that. My miscommunication mailbox is probably overflowing by now. Not that I can get to a computer. Not that it matters, considering the site keeps crashing. And to top it all off, suddenly I've become a soccer champion who desperately needs to find a bathroom. Whoa, whoa! What are you doing? Sorry, I forgot you were there. Besides, I'm busting over here. Don't talk about it. I am too, and I'm trying not to think about it. Right. Good idea. Don't think about it. Hey, guys. I was just going to track you down after I went to the bathroom. Uh, it's all this water I've been drinking. <laughs> they say it's good to drink a lot of water, but all this running to the bathroom a gazillion times a day... Wait! What? You wanted to see me? Oh, yeah. I found the glitch with the school's website, so that recipe you were trying to download should come through any minute. And there it is. Great! Huh? Huh? Uh, so I downloaded a few more recipes than I realized. <laughs> Mad. Chill. It's not that bad. Turns out we're a great team on the soccer field. Ugh. Stinky, we are not a great team. Not on the soccer field, not anywhere. This may come as news to you, but I too have important things to do, including going to the bathroom. <gasps> there you are. Where have you been? It's where I'm going that's important, and we are going home to look for the key to these stupid uh. handcuffs so I can get on the computer and, and... Uh, read recipes? Yes, I've got recipes to read. Oh. Oh. Very important recipes. Recipes that need my expert opinion. <laughs> this is a special announcement. Samuel Parker to the principal's office immediately. I'm sorry, but Principal Hardacre is going to have to wait. Sorry, no can do. <sighs> Don't worry, Mad. We'll go to your house and look for the key. Please, and hurry. Um, would you mind avoiding the stairs whenever possible? <clears throat> Here already? Stinky, if I have to sit in detention with you. No, Maddie, it's something much more noble than that. Are you sure you want Madison to know? 
I can't see any way around it, sir. And I'm not about to let a pair of silly old handcuffs get in the way of my duties. Well, in that case, Samuel, we've had a call for... The Kitten Whisperer. I'm sorry, but you don't expect me to believe that Stinky is... <laughs> <laughs> it's just too funny. <laughs> Laugh all you want, but it's true. I am the Kitten Whisperer. <laughs> what? You talk to kittens. <laughs> you! <laughs> More than that. I am able to calm the distressed, the frantic, the troubled, any kitten in need. And so I have made a pledge to use my gift. <laughs> Ears? Whiskers? <laughs> hey, the kittens seem to respond to it, okay? Come rain, hail, or shine, kittens the world over can rest easy. Knowing that I, Stinky, will come to their rescue. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm still having trouble accepting. <laughs> I, I mean, is this really happening? Stinky, here are the details of your mission. <laughs> mission? <laughs> oh, please, please. Travel safe, my friend. something. What if there is no key? Don't even think that. Poor Mad. <laughs> Amelia, what have you done? trouble. No, no, I mean, whoa! I sense something very strange, powerful, something. Anyway, maybe you start in the kitchen while I go through this mess. What was that? How long do you think this kitten whispering is gonna take? As long as it takes. It's just that I really need the bathroom, as I'm sure you do, and... Shh! Do you hear that? No. Now, about my... There! <coughs> Hurry! Don't worry, little guy. The kitten whisperer is here. Okay, you're going to have to follow my every step. You don't expect me to walk through that. There is no way I'm walking through that. The Kitten Whisperer will not be stopped by a little bit of mud or a silly girl who happens to be handcuffed to his wrist. So you better get yourself together because we are rescuing that kitten whether you like it or not. Fear not, my furry uh, friend. Almost there. See, it's not uh, as bad as uh, you thought. No, not nearly as bad as I thought. Okay, little fella, nearly there. I know, but she's a girl. What do you expect? What? Are you complaining about me to the kitten? Well, he asked. Now just walk to Stinky. You can do it. That's it. One more. There you go. You're safe now. I've... <gasps> ah! Okay, so how do we get out of this one? Let's check Maddie's room. I don't know. I can feel something weird going on here. Something I've never felt before. Oh, Rainbow, stop being so dramatic. Hey, girl, you want to play fetch? There it is 
again. <laughs> See? She can sense it, too. I told you something weird was going on. No, she just wants to play fetch. <laughs> you want to play fetch? You want to play fetch? <laughs> Amelia? I don't think I can hold on much longer. Do you mean in this particular position or for the bathroom? Both. Seth, me? Oh, just hanging with Stinky. What? I'll be right there. There's something wrong with Amelia. We have to get home right now. Yep, happy to follow your lead on that one. Hmm, that mud was kind of soft and squishy, wasn't it? Oh no, there is no way I'm gonna. Hey, Kitten Whisperer, what was that pledge of yours? Come rain, hail, or shine. I was for kittens, not dogs. Bad luck. On my count. One, two, three! <laughs> he says that was fun, and we should do it again. Is there any way you could talk to Amelia and find out what's wrong with her? Nothing personal, Mad, but I've never really connected with Amelia or dogs in general. But, hey, I'll give it my best shot. You know, Stinky, I'm glad I got to see this side of you. Aw, oh, gee, Matt. But if you whisper one word about this to anyone... Hey, trust me when I say, your secret's safe with me. Hold up. They've been up there for ages. I knew something was up. I'm still sensing weird vibes in here. I just feel bad for Maddie. I mean, she's been stuck with Stinky for practically the whole day. Like, he could do anything to help Amelia. He's probably up there making a fool of himself. Hey, look! <gasps> she's saved! I'm sorry, I'm finding it really hard to understand her. Maybe if we had some time alone. Sure, whatever you need. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, this is getting really old. Maddie, look what I found! Saffron, you're a lifesaver! What is he still doing up there? Why won't he come down? Oh, he's just, uh, he's, he's having a, hold on. Dear Maddie, I was your age when I got this magic kit. I rediscovered it in my cousin's attic. I thought you'd get a kick out of it. It's so old fashioned. Oh. Just a little something to let you know I'm always thinking about my little girl. That's so beautiful. That's my dad. Guess I'll always be his little girl, no matter how old I get. You know what that means, don't you? Years and years of bad presents? <laughs> <laughs> Just between you and me, Amelia, I'm pretty sure I got the gist of what you were saying. But that can be our little secret, okay? <laughs> cool, because if what you were saying is true, do you know what this means? Do you know the power this wand will give me? I'll be invincible! Oh, it's just too good to be true, so I just point it and wish, right? Aha! Ah! Doggone it. Maybe I don't understand dogs as well as I thought. Magic wand. Huh. When I said look for the key, I didn't mean turn the place inside out. Hey, it was like this when we got here. She's gonna kill me when she sees this mess! Quick, all hands on deck! Well, guess I'll see you around. Oh, no you don't! You owe me for getting you out of that tree! What tree? Just clean! Dear Real Deal, I don't know if any one person ever truly knows every part of us. And I don't know if it's important that they do. One thing's for sure, we will always be little children to our parents. Maybe a friend to someone. Maybe even surprise people every now and then by showing a magical side they never knew existed. 
The point is, you can be one thing to one person, but you don't need to be everything to everyone. Just reveal what feels right and let the rest be a surprise. Because surprises are always fun. G to G, miscommunication. Hi, I'm home. Hi. Hi. Amelia, time for your hypnosis. What is she doing? She's just doing doggy things. Oh dear, well that's odd. I'll have to tell the hypnotist about that. 